Well, good day and welcome to Morning. Investigators in Cars. Good and, afternoon. Uh, good afternoon. Whatever time you're watching this, it's a good time. But uh, Investigators in Cars, I'm uh, Mark Bernan, and this is my wife and partner, Wendy Bernan. Hello, everyone. Hello, how are you? And today is uh, Private Investigator Day. It's National Private Investigator Day. Wow. Who knew that? But there I was had even a day. no idea, but I think that's cool. Is that like a Hallmark uh, holiday? <laughs> yeah. This would be a National Secretary's Day. Who'd ever heard of that? Yeah, we didn't get any cards. We didn't get any cards oh, for wow. Private Investigator Day. We didn't day. get any flowers. I didn't either. I didn't. I got to get you some flowers. All right. Next year we got to get Next year we got to get, year, we gotta get this a little more planned yeah, here. Yeah. But it is a Private Investigator Day. Day. Private Investigator Day. And so look it up on a hashtag. But uh, oh, Winnie, what is your what is your uh, favorite fictional private investigator? Who's your favorite? Hmm. Well, I have a couple. I mean, growing up, I loved the Nancy Drew series. Really? Yeah. Guess what I read? The Hardy Boys. Ah, uh, how'd you know? Okay. <laughs> All right. I mean, those are great. And I just saw the Nancy Drew movie when we flew up to Minneapolis. But um, I would have to say, I just started reading Agatha Christie oh. and Miss Marple, and I loved her. I just thought. Um, she was cool. Why? What was cool about her? Well, I related to her because she saw things that the, you know, she was helping the police solve crimes, which we which don't happens do. all the time. <laughs> but we don't in do fiction. that. So I thought that was cool. But she saw things that you know the men didn't see and that drove them crazy. And so they just started asking her after a while. Well, what did you see, Miss Marple? Or what do you think? <laughs> yeah, cause because police are really open to that here. <laughs> yeah, because she was, you know, she's a woman. She has this intuition. That's true. She would knew what went on in the village. She knew everybody, and so um, it was just. I thought it was fun. It was a fun book to read. Was she a licensed private investigator? She was not. No. I can't believe it. So no. she's actually breaking several yes, laws. Yes, yes. And they would call her into the crime scenes. And, you know, yeah, because that happens all the time too it's in fiction, real life. Yeah. It's so fiction. who was your favorite? <laughs> My favorite one was uh, growing up was Jim Rockford, and I thought, boy, that'd be a lot of fun. Except uh, two things: I hate getting shot at, and I hate getting conked in the head. <laughs> Okay. You can do some serious uh, traumatic brain injury by getting conked yeah. in the head all the time. And does but, that happen in real life? Uh, no, thank goodness. Thank goodness. No. I conk myself out occasionally yeah. when I'm training. but uh, Or someone else has knocked me out in training a couple yeah. times. But uh, no, it's nothing like... Television is just... That's why it's called fiction. Yes. But I did read uh, I did read a character, uh, um, uh, Lou Archer. Uh -huh. I read all the Dashiell Hammett books, uh, the Continental Op. Uh, I read uh, Raymond Chandler's book, Philip Marlowe. But Lou Archer... Out in uh, by Ross McDonald were the finest series of detective novels I ever read. And, uh, but I did read a series that kind of got me. They were reality based uh, in San, an agency in San Francisco. That's really how I learned a couple of tricks from the trade. Oh, okay. So, but our question is, uh, who is your favorite fictional private eye, yes. a private detective? Uh, go ahead and fill it down in the comments section down below. Uh, consider subscribing to the channel. We're always looking for subscribers. If you subscribe, we'll send you a couple of our cool coasters, yeah. which we never seem to have with us here. Yeah. Okay, next video, we will show you our, uh, coasts, uh, our coasters. But if you subscribe to Investigators in Cars Drinking Coffee, send us your uh, information. We will mail you a couple of bona fide. We can put them on the website. We can put them on the website as well. Or the YouTube. On the YouTube channel. Yes. So just click and uh, subscribe and like those. We'll send those out to you so you have those. But send us your comments about your favorite fictional private investigator and why. Which movies did you like? Oh, I got a couple of classics. We just watched uh, just watched uh, uh, Farewell, My Lovely with uh, Robert Mitchum um, as private investigator mm -hmm. Philip Marlowe. Thank goodness our lives aren't anything like that. First of all, we don't live in a trailer. We actually make a little bit of money to pay for the uh, studio we have here. Yes. But, uh, all right, but again, we had a great time. It is National Private Investigator Day, so if you know a private investigator, take them to lunch. <laughs> or call us, and we'll go to lunch with you. That's right. That's but, right. Uh, thanks for joining us here in Investigators in Cars, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.